Whether you're new to ProShow Web or just need to brush up on a few basics, this video will show you how to get up and running with your first video slideshow in just a few minutes. The first thing to do is to go to ProShowWeb.com and sign into your account. If you don't already have an account, it's free to sign up. To get started with the new show, click the New Show button. The first thing that you'll be prompted to do is to choose a theme. A theme is a collection of effects that gets applied to the photos and videos in your show. You can browse different categories to choose themes by occasion or choose a theme from the preview list. To see the types of effects used by a theme, simply press the preview button that appears above the thumbnail. Let's choose Damask Elegance and then click the Create Show button down here at the bottom. Next, give your show a name and then click the Create Show button. This is the main workspace for ProShow Web. This is where you'll find all the tools you need to create your first show. Right here in the middle, you'll see this notice to add some content. You can click the green Add Content hyperlink in the middle of the page, or click the Add Content button at the top left of the screen to begin. You can add photos and videos from your computer, or choose from a variety of online sources where you might have photos and videos already stored, such as Facebook and Instagram. Let's click on the From Your Computer option. From here, you can browse your computer for photos or video clips, and then press Open. This will upload your content to ProShow Web and place your images into a new slideshow. Once added, you can rearrange the order of your photos and videos by simply clicking and dragging. For this example, I'm creating a wedding video, so I'll want to add a title slide that introduces the couple. In the toolbar above my images, I'll click the Add Content button. This time, instead of adding more photos, I'll select the Add Title Slide option. From here, you can type any text you'd like and then press the Add button. Just like photos and videos, you can move this title slide by clicking and dragging it into place. Now, let's add some music to our slideshow. Click the Add Music button in the toolbar. Here, you'll see two options. You can either upload your own MP3 tracks from your computer, or select a song from the built-in royalty-free music library. In the ProShow Web Music Library, use the Tempo, Length, or Category filters on the left to find the perfect song to match your slideshow. You can preview any track by pressing the play icon. When you find songs that you really like, click the star icon. This will instantly add the song to your favorites list. With a track selected, click the Add Track button at the bottom to add it to your slideshow. When you add music to a slideshow, by default, ProShow Web will automatically sync your slides to match the total length of all of the songs you've added. You can change the Auto Sync option by clicking on the Settings button in the bottom right corner. In the middle of the page, you'll see the option for Energy. To change the Auto Sync, click the Custom option, and then use the slider to choose a custom energy level. Simply drag the slider bar to the right for a faster paced show, or to the left to create a slower paced show. Press the Done button at the bottom of the window to save your changes. Now that you've added all of your content, it's time to make your slideshow. At the top of the screen on the right, click the Build Video button. ProShow Web will quickly begin to combine all of your photos, videos, and music together into a slideshow that you can watch and share. After your show has been built, you can always make changes if you need to. If you click the Remix button in the toolbar, ProShow Web will automatically rebuild your show. The theme, content, and music settings will be the same, but this time ProShow will use a different combination of effects. For more advanced editing, clicking the Edit Show button allows you to go back and make changes to any aspect of your slideshow, including content, theme, music, effects, and even timing. 
Once you're happy with the way your video looks, use the options in the toolbar to share online or download and save videos to your computer. You can instantly share to sites like Facebook and YouTube, send people a link to view your slideshow online, or embed a video on your blog or website. When you click the download button, you'll see all the options available for downloading your video, from standard 360p video all the way up to full 1080p HD video for our premium subscribers.